Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's a little bit of an update. Well, and a quick look at this engine, or these two engines. This is a little thing I took off it. I think it's like a 7 horsepower, 6.9 or a 212, I'm not, I'm not sure exactly. Bit of a no-brander. I know this thing's a 13 horsepower. The dude I bought it off was pretty sure it was a 13 horsepower, so... Looks like a 13 horsepower. Honda Clone GX390 or something. I would have it around the other way, but that torque converter is pretty sexy. I love that thing. It's like fucking brand new 40 series. Struggling to find one. I was going to order one from GoPower Sports. Uh, but they wanted like 600 bucks by the time I got to Australia. So I went and uh, seen this dude. And he hooked me one up here in uh, Australia in Perth for like 300 bucks or 299. Might as well say 300. Yeah, if you're in Australia and you want one, or if you're in Perth, ring that mobile number. His website's there. It's got a, a Facebook thing. Type in uh, Roto or Ro Rato Australia. Can't really pronounce it. Whatever it is. Type that on Facebook, you'll find it. But the the progression update today. Well, now I tacked in these uh, supports because I extended the chassis there. So I thought I'd better put some strength there. Same over this side. This shock's all tacked in with its little fucking fancy tab things. Made out of fucking angle iron. It's pretty strong. And this one here, I'm starting to do this one now, so I've made these up, I'm going to make the plate, well done, and then get onto these ones, and I might, um, I don't know if I'll weld all this shit up solid, get that over and done with, get that engine plate made up, and start trying to make this uh, engine rises here, rise that engine up. Clear that wheel with that torque converter and that. Yeah. It's come along. Been on in about two hours now. Yeah. So I should finish it today, I'm pretty confident.